Hey, so I'm downloading this game and uh, just have a few minutes left before it starts. In the meantime, I wanted to just share this uh, enthusiasm I have for this little app. Um, it's a, a program to make trees and it has a couple of really interesting features. Some nice rendering. It's actually a, kind of a game uh, engine or a tool to create trees for games. And so one of the things you'll see is that you can export it to a couple of formats, such as the dark or basic object uh, game engine, Autodesk Filmbox, Wavefront, DirectX. Uh, Wavefront OBJ, that's uh, the format we'll use in Dark Waffle. So you can actually export your trees that you create here, export them to OBJ and start using them. Although the, the images, the textures that are mapped on them, are in a format that we don't quite use at this time, so you'll need to convert those. I'm going to be working probably on some sort of a tutorial to show how to do that. But in the meantime, I just wanted to kick this off. Opening the, the presets of the trees that come with it. By the way, this, this thing uh, is called Tree It, and it is free. It's a free program. It's uh, pretty amazing, um, uh, particularly when you look at this. So let's take, for instance, the uh, good old acacia. All right, there's a couple of trees. In fact, there's different objects for just the leaves and sort of a subleaf section and then the whole tree together. I'm going to load that one and um, look at that. It's even moving in the wind. So first of all, you can rotate it quite nicely and view it. And it does some nice, nice thing with the shading, with the volumetric shadows. But th there's also simulated winds. So if you see the articulation, the, the branches, the leaves moving with the wind, swaying. And I think that's a nice touch. That's really nice. Anyway, so that's something that um, you can use to actually build your trees. And uh, perhaps it'll start from an existing one. And right, let's take one more. Let's say, for instance, a uh, good old oak tree and load this oak tree here. And there it is, a good old, good size old oak tree. And, uh, you know, it's, it's beautiful because you can, you can easily see using this perhaps inside of uh, inside a game or inside of Howler, actually, with maybe a scene where the background, you're going to have your 3D rendering of the landscapes, the mountain scenes. And in the foreground, you have a tree, and maybe you'll even have a, a bird or a squirrel or some other animal sitting nearby. And I think it's very inspiring to see this. This is running quite smoothly and nicely on my rather old laptop, so it uh, should be really uh, a good experience for you guys, too. All right, just wanted to share that. Let's do just one more here um, boom, 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 before my game starts. Let's do one of the palm trees. There you go. Look at that. Swaying in the wind, animated like the breeze, the ocean breeze is blowing it apart. Beautiful. Anyway, um, hope this is going to inspire you to try that. Look it up. It's called Tree It. And um, well, the website is probably here somewhere. About evolved-software.com evolved-software.com looks pretty good all right enjoy